hi everyone welcome back to the channel aries the emperor here i am back with another general reading for all of my aries collective if you are new here welcome this is an all aries channel for all of my aries placements cross watchers you are welcome as well to everyone just take in mind this reading may or may not resonate um so do not force the reading okay Thank you. Special thank you to all of you who like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for donating your comments. Um, thank you for sharing. And to, to those of you who book personal readings and shop the website, I have concluded the sale at this time. Um, I received a question on which of my candles are intention candles. They all are. Um, this one in particular is just Rich as You, which has green jade. Um, and it just depends on what you are wanting to, to manifest, attract, um, or just incorporate into a self-care regimen for yourself here. Um, jade represents prosperity, wealth, good luck, good health, um, among other things. All right. So all of my info is down below. If you need to contact me, book personal readings or shop vegan friendly products, as well as my second channel, kiss my Cosmo. All right. And sp thank you guys as well. The compliments, my hair. Um, thank you. I, I really appreciate it, but I guess I'm like, I'm transforming on here. Just, just like you guys are transforming in real life and um, it's a journey, you know, we're going to see how things um, turn out, <laughs> but nonetheless, I'm here for it. So let's get into it. Let's see what messages come out for you. And I am working to get reading, um, to get all orders out behind the scenes. Um, I am a one woman show. All right. So just give your girl a little grace. All right, let's get into it. Even if you're not doing anything wrong, you are being watched and recorded. I did a reading similar to this not too long ago. It still applies more than ever at this time. Star card, Aquarius energy. Let me cover this up. Because they be trying to censor you, child. All right, we got the star card. Aquarius energy. As you know, we're sun in Aquarius um, tomorrow is, is new moon in Aquarius. We're in the age of Aquarius. So we're in the midst of a Aquarius storm, right? We're in the eye. So this will be a time either, um, where connections in your life, um, uh, may, may start to come to the forefront, or you may start to see right through or see a little clearer with this star card and the moon energy. All right. So literally an aquarius moon what aquarius energy out here thank you for oh for clarifying spirit but this is a, a energy of of you being watched you being viewed as an mvp figure you being viewed as rookie of the year you know you being viewed as just up next you know, or, or just one of them ones is, is the type of energy that this is giving here. You know, you are somebody who, there are people who are worthy of studying, you know, in this lifetime and, and figures who have been studied, um, or considered great at what they do. Um, and, and your energy to those around you, you know, you have study worthy energy. You know, you have the energy that people would like to, to see if they can repeat on their own time and get the same results. Five of Swords energy, but still pretend like you don't exist, huh? but still watching you, still hating on you, you know what I mean? Or um, still silently having this stupid battle with you um, or trying to one up you in their minds, you know, and then literally that's where it stays in their mind because you, you, you can pay them dust. You literally are, you, you don't have time for that is what this energy is giving here. And a lot of y'all at this point, you know, you don't care that people are watching you, that you probably think they need to watch you so that they can learn how to do the shit right, you know, or, or so that they can, um, Or so that they can't get a life is what I should have said. 
And not only that, Aquarius rules over the future and the internet for me, social media, especially different platforms um, that are out there. And not only that, actual camera surveillance. Um, like I said, when you walk outside, you know, whether it's your camera or your neighbor's camera, somebody is watching you somewhere, you know, and we are as a society pushing more forward into the future. Um, and, and as you see, you know, that type of technology is, is, is going to start to, to become like the air we breathe. It already is. You can't go to sleep without your cell phone charging next to your damn head. Like, that's where you get oxygen from, right? So what you think they're going to do with that? Oh, they're going to keep pushing forward with that. You know, you're in the midst of a change. You know, change is happening for and to a lot of y'all right now. All right, it's like they say, it's like the turn of a century here. You're experiencing that esoterically. Astrologically speaking. Boom, full card. What's in her hand? Cell phone. Aries energy. You just watch how this affects you. That's what you need to be focused on. That's a part of you seeing the bigger picture in life right now or in, in your immediate life. It's a new beginning though. And also, it's a phone. She's watching it. She's taking a picture here. This is giving social media energy, a platform of some sort here. Or somebody who ain't shit is looking for you. Seven of Swords. I can't make this up. Somebody that probably deserves to be karate chopped could be looking for you could be watching you and this is energies that you have blocked still trying to find a way to keep tabs on you this could be uh, an energy of people creating fake social media pages to keep tabs on you this could be people playing on your phone. This could be people who are trying to find out private information about you. Yeah, we got the star card and the nine of cups. Who are you? Cause you leaving a trail of tears on your way out. And did I not say something about most valuable player, rookie of the year? You're all of those things in one. It's like somebody saying, yeah, I know them like the back of my hand. I studied them. I know their routines. And it's like you coming back like, nah, you think you know, bitch, but you have no idea. Or no, you don't know nothing. You thought you knew. It's like people are, some of y'all, people are attracted to parts of you.
but it's just giving an energy of either some of these people in your life have deserved to be blocked or they do deserve to be blocked. And if you've gone the route of having to block out certain energies, they still watch you. It's like an energy with the star here. Especially if, you, if you've if you gone through a healing phase. And people will go to as far as to study you so much. And I went... When they feel like you may be superior to them. Or they don't feel like things are fair when it comes to them matching up with you. You know, they'll go as far as to taking your strengths. And trying to weaponize them against you. To try and weaken you. And they'll even go as far as taking your weaknesses, your vulnerabilities, a.k.a. Chiron. And they'll play with that. They'll trigger that in you. Even if you've done nothing to them. Five of Swords. Y'all, I promise when I just flipped this card over, it was laying on top of the star card like this. The Five of Swords was... As I'm saying, all of this triggers vulnerabilities, stab wounds. They did they wounds. That's what Chiron is. Things about yourself that you may not want to share to the rest of the world here, or they may be an insecurity or something that you don't you keep close down there. It's like you have the power to, to hit people in those places. So they feel like some people feel like they still need to watch you and keep tabs on you. But somebody not even war, ready for a, a battle with you, let alone a war. So you got haters, you got people that's loosely keeping tabs on you and you still out here winning. Some of y'all could have ties to martial arts. My battery is low, you guys. Let me wrap this up. But you being watched. Like, look at this girl here. She not watching her or nah? Yeah. Two of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Page of Swords, Aquarius Energy. Watch, watch, watch. All eyes on you. And this got a lot to do with money and emotion page of swords it came out yeah watching your money 
and if what's going on with you is actually real. Four of Pentacles, the moon. Watching you. Did I not say this is about emotion and money? Four of Pentacles, and what came out? Emotion and money. This is emotion, the moon card, and the Four of Pentacles is, um, is money. Or this is some type of blockage here. Or this is some type of nerve that you've hit. This is some type of end of the road here. And you've, you've done nothing wrong. You know, but someone is observing you. And they are coming to the conclusion. That they're just as fake as they come off. You know, this is where they, this is where they get off. This is their stop. For a lot of you guys out here you're gonna start to see that you've been an ace all this time whether somebody's watching you or not 1202 on the clock but just know you are mvp you know you 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 are that to be watched out for and in the spiritual looked out for. You know, it's, it's just like um, you got people out here window shopping. They wouldn't dare be able to come up in, in your stove and purchase, knock over, fuck up anything inside of it without getting booted up out on their ass here. All they can do is watch you and record you and, and try and repeat but still hate on you behind the sidelines. And you ain't really even done nothing to anybody. If anything, you have tried to, not to say people please, but you have tried to give out parts of you, you know, or to be cordial and be cool with these people the whole time. They've been fake this entire time and you're not doing that no more. You done found a new hobby and it's working out for you. You're winning in this department now. You're being appreciated in this department now. And they're going to continue to watch. And they're going to continue to hate. But one thing about it, like I said here, you are still winning. You're still great. You're still journeying along. You still, you you still maintaining. You still balling. You still smiling. So whether they watching or not, when the camera does pan over to you, you got that big cheese on you, a big grin, full energy. It's like you taking a selfie. And you tell them keep watching. I'm going to leave this reading here, y'all. Hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me. I'll catch you later. Ciao.